Hello and welcome to this DBC tutorial. I'm Martin from DBC and today I'm just going to walk you through setting up a very basic problem in DBC. This example that you can see here is our LA model and you can grab this from dbc.co.uk on the downloads page and have a play around with it. So the first step when setting up a problem is to load bathymetry and I'm just going to grab my file here and as it doesn't have any georeferencing information I have to tell DBC just how big that file is and I know that it's 290 kilometers across. We start off with one source and one probe and we can click and drag these and put them where we want in the project. We can also have any number of sources and probes. We're going to set our frequency range and to make this solve quite quick I'm just going to choose a very low frequency range here and use the normal mode solver. Setting a spectrum for our source and I'm going to take a value from the database in this example vibration piling. The next step is to put in our speed of sound profile so if we have our profile we can set it in the graph here or in the table and then we set our seabed. Now we can have any number of layers in the seabed but for this example we'll just take one layer and we'll make it mud. We can choose a weighting for our output results. In this example we'll just leave it unweighted. A lot of work has gone in recently into speeding up the solve, particularly by using multiple cores on modern machines uh, and that's really sped up the solve phase. And here we have our output results. So we can uh, spin and rotate the model as we want and we can also look at those results in cross-section. So here we drag this cross-section endpoints and go to the cross-section view. So that was a very rapid look at DBC and what it can do. Thanks very much for watching.